after the tragic events of the Super Bowl parade in Kansas City, um, it didn't feel right without you guys hearing from us first. Travis and Jason Kelsey shared their thoughts on the Kansas City Super Bowl parade shooting during their New Heights podcast on February 19th. Attention 92 percenters, we, um, we have a pre-recorded episode for you guys coming up on Wednesday. But um, after the tragic events of the Super Bowl parade in Kansas City, um, it didn't feel right without you guys hearing from us first. We just wanted to say, you know, our hearts go out to all of the victims, their families, Chiefs Kingdom, and really all of Kansas City uh, that was really there on a day to try and celebrate the community. And um, it's unfortunate and, and deeply tragic, the events that occurred. Um, so, you know, we also want to thank the local law enforcement that sprang into action, the first responders on scene, um, and anybody that's uh, uh, been willing to help uh, those affected by this tragedy. Travis took a moment to highlight the KC Strong Emergency Fund for the listeners, emphasizing its importance before Jason discussed the unity and resilience of the Kansas City community in the face of adversity. We'll share a link to donate to the Chief's Emergency Response Fund in our bio. Your donation goes to supporting victims and their families, um, violence prevention, and uh, mental health services, and the first responders. One of the things that's evident is how much Kansas City is coming together and rallying around the people that have been affected by this. And, uh, you know, one of the beautiful things that we have in doing this podcast is a wonderful community out there. Uh, the 92 percenters, everybody that watches this show, we're still figuring out a way for us to be involved. And yeah. obviously you can donate to these links right now, uh, but we plan on doing something in the future. We're trying to get that situated right now, have some ideas, but uh, just make sure you, you're, you're following and we'll be telling you guys in ways that we're going to try and get involved. Before concluding their message, Travis addressed the fans and residents of Kansas City directly, offering words of support and solidarity. 92 percenters, we appreciate you. Kansas City and Chiefs Kingdom, we love you guys. We're with you guys, um, and we'll see you guys soon. Consecutive Super Bowl victory. The event was marred by gunfire. Lisa Lopez Galvin, aged 43, tragically lost her life, and at least 22 others were injured in the incident. Two juveniles have been charged in connection to the shooting, this event prompted Travis Kelsey to publicly express his sorrow. On the day of the incident, he took to X, formerly known as Twitter, to share his grief, stating, I am heartbroken over the tragedy that took place today. My heart is with all who came out to celebrate with us and have been affected. KC, you mean the world to me. In response to the tragedy, his organization, 87 and Running, contributed $100,000 to a GoFundMe account aimed at supporting the Ray family, whose two daughters were among the injured. Additionally, Taylor Swift, who is in a relationship with Travis, made a significant donation of $100,000 to the family of Lisa Lopez Galvan.